So, I mean, I think going through this program, so in, I'll just start back like to vet school. I started seeing a therapist. And then I feel like after vet school, I still needed to talk to somebody, but I never really made it a priority. Like I knew okay. that it needed to be, but I was just like, eh, I have all these other things to do. Like this is number 15 on the list. Like it's not that important. So I think going through the program helps to hold myself accountable for prioritizing um, well-being, but also just coming to that realization and making that like promise to myself, just giving that to other people because I stepped into a leadership position in the hospital and I like can see other people like struggling through it. Um, and we rely on our team so much to do everything in the day to day. And especially since the pandemic of us spending more time with each other really than anybody else. Um, I felt that it was really important to give that tool to other people and kind of have them to prioritize themselves so that they can be more present um, at work, you know, and, and feel like they have support at work too. I have since I started the program, because it had taken a backseat and I had some really bad experiences with trialing some therapists, I did find one and I see her regularly. So that's helped me a lot because for me, I always thought like, oh, I'm just a worrier but it turns out I have anxiety. So it kind of felt good to know because I was always like rationalizing, are my feelings valid for a lot of the time? Like, why am I so stressed out about this? Like, why am I worrying? Why am I ruminating? But it made more sense. So now it's like, okay, I know what's going on. Now I can make steps towards like managing it. The ability to stop and, and recognize like even though it's you know been a hard day like what are the positives I think that really resonated with me from like all the modules I felt like it's a simple but easy thing like even now everything that's going on with my pets one of the things that I felt like I was grateful for is that I have the resources and ability to take care of them fast and like easy um, just having that support even through all of this has been great. So I think just like even simple things like that, just restructuring how I am looking at the, the challenges. I don't think I would have made the well-being initiative for the hospital. Um, and it took a few times of me talking about it, like writing it out and then hearing other people get excited about it. So that was a big thing for me. I would say to really give your undivided attention because I feel like during the pandemic, we got thrown so much CE. It kind of became like, okay, I'm like doing this and multitasking doing something else. So one of the tips I would say is to really set a time aside where you have your undivided attention and focus um, and just like be present with the material, I think was a big thing because that's how you get the most out of it. So it would depend why. I noticed on the website, like you can do certain modules. So if they wanted to do a trial or even talk to other people that have been through the program of why they would be on the fence to convince them otherwise, um, just because I don't really see any negatives. Um, even with time, like it's time well spent.